Hello there, welcome back to some more Fire Emblem Engage. In the last episode, what we did was we ran away, bravely, bravely ran away, um, and we didn't get any of our emblems back. But we got two more, we got Lynn and Lucina, so we have something to work off of, which I will use gratefully. I'm now able to play Wyvern Ride. What? Hi, Lucina. Yes. We faced each other's vicious enemies, but now I'm your staunchest ally. Thank you. And then Lynn. Hi, Lynn. Yes. We fought for the Foul Dragon, but for now on, Ivy and I are here for you. Yeah, until the Foul Dragon takes them away again. Fuck. Right. So I've got the Lucina Ring. Which I get a type bonus for because I'm Dragon. Ally chain attacks are guaranteed to hit. Okay. And then Ivy has Lynn's Ring. Crawl doubles. Okay, so as long as you keep attacking the same person over and over again, you have good. Furnace initiates combat inflicts hit 10, and then if unit of initiates combat inflict avoid minus 10. But they're already like pretty close to, well, he is pre promoted. He has 116 rating. Which makes him one of the highest people in the game besides Josephus. In terms of ability. Just out of the gate. It's pretty good. Um, right, you know the drill. Let's do the old skip at Rue until we get some new stuff to do. See you then. Got some new goods in stock. Let me know if anything suits your fancy. What we got? We have steel swords. Iron blades. Steel lances. We've got quite a lot of stuff now. We can buy Al Surges and Al Fires. We can buy shield, Steel Hand Arts and Shielding Arts. Cool. Take right. Care. See you in a second. Thank you. Thank you for inviting me to this holy place, Divine One. I cannot wait to explore its beauty. <sighs> oh, Father. No, I can't keep looking backward. For body is sake, we must press forward. Ah. This holy land is a touch too flashy for my taste. At least I will not be bored. Listen. Once we've rested, let's head straight for Solm. I won't disgrace Father by hesitating now. Uh, Let me guess, here for strengthening, I can see the drive in your eyes. No, actually, I'm here to talk to you. I see you're staring at me again, Divine One. I was... again. <laughs> Sorry. I just can't help it. You know I don't mind. It's pretty neat, in fact. That said... I can think of better ways for you to feel good than just admiring my confidence. Such as? A hundred laps around the Somniel. Like, running? Even I get stressed sometimes. And when I do, I always go for a run. As long as I'm running, my mind is empty. It's like I'm sweating out all my troubles. Huh. Still, are a hundred laps really necessary? In my experience, yes. Anything less runs the risk of a few stray lingering doubts. So, how about it? You interested? Yes, I think. Great, let's get started. You mean now? No time like the present. Do you want to get confident or not? I hadn't planned on running a hundred laps today, but I guess it's worth a try. You're on, Etie. Let's go for a run. Now you're talking. Support level B. Okay. Let's have a look at Riven Ride. Or Wyvern Ride. Depends how you want to pronounce it, I suppose. You know, just play Wyvern Ride. Hmm? Do you want to attempt a Wyvern Ride? Yes. Sure. Yes. Understood. I shall call Prince Ivy, Princess Ivy for you. In Wyvern Ride, you fly through a course while shooting floating targets. Try to hit the special targets and aim for a high score. More costs will unlock as you progress in the story. Which would you like? I'd like the normal course, please. And I'll ride with Sommy, of course. Nice How does this work? Can I use gyro aim? No, I can't. 
Maybe I can turn it on, but... got to remember there's a very slight delay between me doing the things and not doing the things. Nearly. Forty one hundred. Does that break? Yeah, okay, so as long as they're connected by a chain, you break all of them. And you get more points for them too. So shooting carefully on the blue ones is more important. Thanks, Tommy. Oh my lord. Having that golden one was a great boon. Never looked directly into the sun. 36,500, is that a good score? I think it's alright. At least to be. Just what I'd expect Ooh. from the Divine One. Nice. Obviously harder without assistance, but... Wow. Until next time. That's good. That's good. Alright. Okay, so let's have a look at any support conversations we've got. Etia and Saline have an A. Behold, Etia. I tried adding honey to the single origin tea, and I think I might have created something new. Really? I'd like to try it. <sighs> Saline, this is incredible. I've never had anything like it. <laughs> Very impressive, Etia. Impressive? What did I do? Your hand no longer shakes. You've mastered your new teacup, haven't you? Not exactly. I just switched to a regular porcelain one. Whatever for? Don't tell me you intend to abandon your training. Oh, I'm still going to train. Just not during our tea times. Forgive me, Etie. This is because I couldn't stop crying, isn't it? No, that's not why. Training is important to me, but the time I get to spend with you is even more important. It's okay to take a break during our tea time. I don't need to try to do both at once. Oh, I see. Every day, the war grinds us down. I don't know how much longer I'll be able to simply relax with you. So, I think it's best I not spend our precious moments together training, too. <sighs> you okay there? I'm touched, Etie, that you'd go so far out of your way for me. Of course. Come on, Celine. Don't you know you're one of my best friends in the world? I could say the same of you, Etie. <laughs> Thank you. That's a real honor. Oh, you're shaking again. That's not from training. I'm just feeling a bit emotional is all. Oh, Etie, come here. You can lean on me whenever you need. Saline. <laughs> 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 Not so tight, Etie. Uh, uh, Etie, you train too much. You're crushing me. I accidentally broke the Princess of Firenze's spine by hugging her too hard. Yunaka and Louis. Louis, hey, hi. Hello there, Yunaka. Have you had a windfall of some sort? Your smile is especially radiant. Oh, gross. Cut the sweet talk before I start puking rainbows. Listen, I got you something. Just a little thank you. Look, look, look! Oh my! One look is enough to tell me that these tea leaves are very fine indeed. I expected nothing less from the master. You've used so many leaves on me. I'm worried you'll be a tealess husk if I don't give back. So, I know it's not much, but I hope you'll accept the donation. It's for a good cause. I am all too happy to accept your gracious gift. I believe I'll brew them right away. You're welcome to join me, of course. Are
Are you sure? I don't want you thinking I got you tea just so you'd brew it for me. Tea is better with two. I enjoy our bracing conversations almost as much as the tea. Right. Conversations. I do enjoy chatting with you. So much so, I kind of worry I might slip up. Meaning? Huh? Um, oh, I just remembered I have a thing. Uh, a thing I gotta do or else, um, yeah, so next time. Oh, that is unfortunate. I confess I was looking forward to spending the whole time talking about myself. You were, uh, planning to spend the whole time talking my ear off about yourself, huh? Yes. I'm just in that sort of mood today. Oh, well, if that's the case, I can set my thing aside as a favor to you, I mean. I'm a great listener, so you can feel free to hold nothing back. Tell me absolutely everything. <laughs> Splendid. I shall put on a pot of tea for us at once. I was just going to bore you with my exploits, you know, nothing major. Okay, so I want to learn what I get from talking to uh, sailing and things, but for that I need to go to the arena. I should also check if I can increase, well, there are people's stuff I can increase first of all, let's do that. Boucheron and myself. Sailing and Alfred. And me and Jean. Got a support conversation, so we can do that one after I've done the arena stuff. I want to see if there is any uh, donations we can do. I don't think so because we still haven't actually been in Illusia properly yet. Oh, we can now. Cool. Next level, and then level three. The Bolganon and the Snowy Set and the Bond Fragments of Thousand. Now I haven't got enough money to do anything like that. But this is, okay, so this is where you go to get gold and silver corrupted. 50 or 60%. Great money chances in Illusia. Cool. Okay, so. That Bolganon is interesting. If I go to, I don't know, plan probably. Manage items. I always forget which one is which. Uh, swap with the Bolganon, but that's an A. I can't. Okay, so I need to have a different kind of person to use that. It's 32 mage strength, though. I wonder if Ivy can use it. No, she can't use it either. So. You need a different kind of type of unit to have. Well, I guess you just need A in magic, which neither of these guys have. So you need someone specifically that has like a sage or something to have A in magic. Anyway, the arena. Oh, I'd like to use some master seal. So I'd like to get RTA level to 20 because she's, she's the closest by a country mile. But first, I want to see what is the benefit of getting Lucina up. Dexterity, dual assist, bow agility and inheritance. Or I can get speed plus two, speed taker, bow focus and skill inheritance again. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Cool, right. So let's do... The yeah, Etier is very close to level 20, so that's why I want to do it. Etier here. Busting in once again. Meditation complete. Yeah, I would need her to miss a shot for me to win. I really thought I had you. But I do it again. It's an unfortunate reality that I just do it again. It's fine. So, I mean, quite a few people are quite close, but ETA is right next to being able to level, so I want to do it. This should be a fun workout. I'm Citrine. Now I might win this one. Of Brodia. Oh my. Nice. I'm still so weak. My muscles deserve a treat after that. Level 20. More strength, more luck. Cool. And now I can level up to the sniper class, which is what I wanted to do. Okay, and then finally, who's next? 
So, 18. Fram is... Is, is Fram really my closest? Oh, Alfred's next, because he's... Like, nearly 20 as well, and I'd like to get a... Uh, Cavalier, Cavalier class go up more. Crown Prince of Firene. I shall serve Ooh. as your opponent today. Oh. With Riders Bane? That's not good. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I still need to work on. It's fine. Okay, so. New shop, new stuff in the items as well. New map in the Tower of Trials. Okay. Um, right, so I would like to use a master seal then change class you can change to the sniper or to a bow knight but I think sniper is what I want as long as I hit someone who can't counter which is easy with the bow I get plus 10 crit my rating doesn't change as high but my um, but I, I kind of feel like I want a, a sniper so that's what I want to do Become Snipper. Wonderful. Of course you can. I'm going to use you in the next skirmish, of course. Um, and then Alfred will eventually, once he gets to level 20... I've still got like two more seals, haven't I? Yeah, three more. So I can make him an Avenir. And he'll get 104. I can, with my dex percentage, which is 17% right now, I'd get, couldn't get half damage, which is pretty good, actually. And then it'll be Fram, who will change into a martial master. But I might change Jean into, like, an actual healer. Because he has other things he can become. Like the High Priest. Yeah. The High Priest is a good time. To let myself heal myself. That's that's good times. Alright. So. That's fine for now. And we've got some more supports to do. Me and Jean. Picking herbs again today, I see. This one really makes a difference in treating all kinds of illnesses and injuries back home. I used to go out all the time with my father to harvest these. I didn't get to talk much with your father on the island. What's he like? Whenever I succeed, in studies or in helping out, he praises me like a well-behaved puppy. But when I mess up, he gets very upset, like he's scolding a misbehaving puppy. So you're a puppy either way, huh? <laughs> now that you mention it... He was the kind of dad where some days we got along and some days I hated him. But in his absence, I appreciate him more. Same with my mother. I didn't realize it when I saw them every day. But I have a lot of respect for my parents. I think the only reason I work so hard now is because of the way they raised me. Jean, that's so beautiful. <laughs> huh? Are you crying? That story about your family was just... very touching. Thank you, Divine One. Here, take this poultice. It's good for swelling around the eyes. <laughs> Thanks, Jean. I needed that. Okay, and then Etia and Jade can have a little chat. That's enough for today. Hmm. Oh. Hey, Jade. Doing some night training? Atta girl. Oh, I'm not training. No need to be so humble. I mean, I see you here, like, every night. No, I mean it. I'm not training. Right, of course. You Brodians always gotta play it off. You can hardly call a quick session like this a workout or whatever. Someday I'll get on your level. <sighs> Sorry, what's that? <sighs> what are you mumbling about? You've got to speak up, Jane. It's nothing. Sure, if you say so. 
What? What? Okay, so seeming like it's going to be a bit longer until we get some wings back, I would like to actually give someone some stuff to do. Um, which means I might need to spend some bond points on getting some more wings so I can actually use them. Uh, Sophia gives me magic. That'll do. Alfred needs to strength or defense. Ogma will do for that. My boy Og. Oggy, Oggy, Oggy. Oi, oi, oi. Uh, and then we need some magic. Linda A will do. And then Yunaka just needs speed. Above all else, she just needs speed. Dexterity and speed will do. Because that means it she'll double people and that's what I want. Okay, cool. So, with that all said and done, if there's nothing else to look at, which I don't think that there is, uh... Well, I should go and check out what these items and stuff are. And also, I might need to replenish my heal staffs. My staves. What you don't want to do is have a load of staves that have like four or five uses in your convoy. But it doesn't matter. I've never ever filled a convoy yet, so it's unlikely to start now. But we'll have a look. I should probably get a re-warp staff. Because that would be quite useful to have. The ability to warp people around the, the map. I could have sworn I had one. Ever doodly not. Hmm. Have some new goods in stock. Please take a look. Okay. Um, Fram. Let us we warp. I thank you. It's a word I can't say. Um, your heal has 11 uses left. That's fine. Physic is also quite good. It's healing from distance. Oh. I can buy master seals and second seals now. So if I get some second seals, I can change my class back to start and just keep leveling again to increase my stats to max. But I need a lot of money for that, um, which I don't have. Jean still has five heals left, so he might actually need a new heal staff. That's fine. I thank you. Um, anyone else? You've got 19 uses of your mend left. That's fine. Do come again. Cool. Uh, now, can I? Have I got like Welcome. any bullion or something to sell? three houses you'd get like a lot of items that did nothing but you could sell them I don't want to sell those nor these why on earth would I sell any of this shit I've got an extra 10 health right here do come again I guess I should seems silly not to if uh Jean is gonna be my defensive powerhouse, then you can be my attack, but if you fuck up, you die. I need A. Okay, so I can't use it yet. I forgot I need, like, the Martial Master, which is what you're going to become anyway, so it's fine. Okay. Right now, I really am done, apart from these two items. Damn you. I should say, check out what the boutique has, but I'm pretty sure I just don't have the money required to do this stuff. Now, I did get a rolled an S tier ring, but I've only ever seen one, and so I assume it's quite unlikely to happen. But it costs 10,000 bond points to make an A ring into an S ring, so I feel like you're only supposed to use them as like a backup. The emblem rings are clearly what you're supposed to be using, which is probably why they took them away from me, because they don't want me to just use them and nothing else. Anyway, let's travel. There might be a new power log. There might be some other things to do. I will have a look at the power logs just in case there's something I can do. As we're going towards Solm. Yes. There were four. I can't do anything in the shadowy moor. Skirmish with gold corrupted in the cathedral. Skirmish fought on the border. A 
Power Log Arena of the Gods, which is base level 19. And the training at Furnay Castle level 20. And the Silver Corrupted, base class level 20 here. So I've never seen Silver Corrupted, so I should probably look at what they... I think that might just be to get the Silver Metal, but I don't know, so I'll have a look. Um, we'll start here, and we'll go all the way around the loop. So see you when I do the cool things. Get people towards level 20, mainly. Plan level drop level 18. More magic, more luck. I'll take it. Alpha level drop level 19. SCA leveled up level 2. More decks, more speed, more build. Need some help? Get <laughs> Josephus levels up to level 5, Divine Dragon. He gets a big XP uh, boosted skill. Divine Spirit ability as well. And Lucina's Bond is level 2, so it gives me Dex plus 2. Bram levels up to level 19. Gets Speed, Strength, Res, Luck, and HP. Saline leveled up to level 19. And got Strength and Luck. Elfwood leveled up to level 20, which is the max level. Speed, Defense, Luck, Strength, and HP, so I can level him up to the next class. You love to see it. And Josephus and Lucina got the the boost. Yeah, without the emblems to help us, it's certainly a lot harder to live. But, you know, we take those. So the silver ones seem to just give you a load of XP when you kill them, rather than the silver material. So that's still good, it's just XP enemies, rather than uh, gold ones. Hello, Princess Saline. Mm. Living here once felt like an undeserved blessing, but I've got accustomed to it now. You're looking a bit grim, Saline. Problems? Ah, Divine One. Do you remember the tea we enjoyed together the other day? It was so good that I'm not likely to forget it anytime soon. It would appear that shipments of those leaves are becoming a favorite target for highwaymen. Changing the trade routes has made little difference. Each day brings more victims. That's awful. I am not often called on to intervene directly in matters such as these. But this is an emergency. And no one in Firenay knows more of tea than I. So Mother has requested that I handle the problem, personally. How do you feel about that? I suspect it may be part of my education. Even if my brother is first in line for the throne, I am still Princess of Firenay. So, what's your plan for dealing with them? I thought I might drive them off with pranks. Ah, uh, wouldn't it be lovely if things were as simple as they are in folk tales? But real life isn't so pastoral. No, it's not. I will show no mercy to anyone who causes suffering to the people of Firenay. And I will go to any lengths so that my people may enjoy the peace they are accustomed to. Don't look at me like that, Divine One. This is a duty I must bear. Now then, please excuse me. Action must be taken in this matter. Swiftly. Okay. While I am here, before I forget, um... Alfred, the level 20, let's change your class to that of the Avenir. You get... 12 more points. That's pretty good. Oh yeah. More defense, more res, more luck, more build, more move, more magic, more speed. Every everything goes up, but I was the, the death going up by 2 is actually quite good. Um Nice. Just, I just don't want to forget that I did that. Cool. Okay, so I would like to, like, boost my friendliness up with loads of people. Let's just get Lin up to five. There's only 400 fragments. I've got so many. I'll be your opponent. I am Lynn of the Lorca tribe. 
victory is yours, but I won't lose next time. Somehow I won. Don't go thinking I'm some wishy-washy noble. I'm stronger than I look. I never thought you seemed weak to begin with. I'd be nowhere without you, Lin. Oh, that's cute. Level 5. If anyone's going to get maximum shit, it's me. The Divine Dragon will become the best friends with everyone. It just makes sense. But for now, that's fine. Okay, so inherit skills. Can I inherit skills from emblems I haven't got? No. Is the answer. Grants a stacking speed plus two each time a unit initiates combat and defeats a foe. Bonus lasts for the rest of the battle, max plus ten. So I can get up to speed plus ten. <laughs> what? So eventually it's like... <laughs> Even a, a knight could start doubling people, I suppose. Like, or stop getting doubled. Anyway, that's that. On to the next... Do some training. Get everyone else or a few more people up to level 20. Got bond level 3 and got dual assist. Plan leveled up to level 19. Magic deck speed and luck. Fluey leveled up to level 14. More strength, more resistance, more luck. More HP. Not more defense, which is a shame, but there we are. Jean leveled up to level 17. More magic, more speed, more res, more luck, more HP. We love to see it. I broke my heel, but that's fine. My heel! Fram level drop level 20. Strength, magic, speed, and res. Bushorn level up level 18. Dex, speed, and HP. Nice. Clan was the MVP this time. And we get a bunch more XP for everyone. Etier gets to level 3. Clan almost levels up to max level. So does Saline. Louis levels up to 15. And Fram is already max, so. More decks, more defense, more luck, more HP. Cool. More strength and more defense. Yes. Yes. 4,000 money, too. Which will get me some Master Seals, which I need because I am almost out of them. Okay, so I've got to make a cut here. Just got to remind myself. I'll be back in just a second. Okay, I'm back. Um, I don't know if I'm wearing the same clothes or not. It's a different day. I got to the two hour mark and needed to call it there. So I'm going to do the old, the final Somniel thing, then the final skirmish, then the paralogue. Enjoy! Welcome. So first thing I need to do is buy two Master Seals, because I'm nearly at the point where I need to. Uh, I have two already. I'll buy Thank one you. more. So that's three. That'll keep me going for a little Do bit. Come again. Then I need to change... Make sure my ears are actually in my earphones, otherwise it will rip again and I have to buy another pair. Hang on. Dun, 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 dun. Right. It's all good. Fram is level 20 already, so I want to change class to the Martial Master. It has an S in pouch. I get three more strength. I lose one res, but I gain a look. And also gain seven. And when a unit is healed by staff or adjacent allies, also recover 50% of the HP that the unit recovered. Oh. Do it. Oh, yeah. Divine Giant is totally going to notice me way more like this. But you're much more powerful. Um, then... Saline is almost done as well, so that might be done by the time they do the arena stuff. Okay, then we check out support relationships just in case. Yunaka, let's start here. What can this humble liar do for you, Divine One? I'd like to have a talk, that's all. I understand, and I'm prepared to accept whatever punishment you have in mind. Punishment? No, I wanted you to know how grateful I've been to have you by my side. Wait, uh, what? That's how I feel. You fight hard every day to protect our allies. 
there's absolutely no reason to punish you. In hindsight, I think the only reason you lied is that we don't know each other very well yet. So, let's change that. Why don't you start by telling me something about yourself, Yunaka? <laughs> Way to put me on the spot. If you don't want to, then I won't cry. Simple as that. <sighs> okay, before I joined up with you, I was sort of just... wandering. Looking for my place in the world. I'd left my old self behind me. I wanted to think I had, at least. You don't sound very fond of your old self. Oh, I like her well enough. Others, though, not so much. That's why she had to go. But I like who I am now. And honestly, I've been having so much fun since we met. <laughs> I'm glad to hear that. Good talk, Yunaka. I think we should do it again sometime. What do you say? You got yourself a deal. It's fairly, you know, inconsequential, but she doesn't seem to be giving that information out to anyone, so... Sailene and Alfred, we can have a little chat. Ugh. What are you doing there, Alfred? Digging another well? Or is this more training? Something like that. Trying to keep up my health, you know? Yeah. If I train hard enough, then... I won't suffer like I used to. Alfred? <sighs> What's wrong? Don't worry, Celine. It's it's just an attack. It'll pass soon. An attack? Is it your old illness? Oh, I was doing so well. A part of my life was supposed to be long gone. Wait here. I'll fetch someone at once. No, stop. What? Why should I? I don't want anyone to see me like this. Not our allies, the emblems, or the divine dragon. I can't let them see this. A weak prince unfit to fight who could collapse any day? None of them would see you that way. They're far too gracious for that. But I would still know. And besides, I don't want them to worry about me. As far as they're concerned, I want to be the spirited prince who loves working out. Just let me rest for a while. I'll be fine. Please, Celine. Very well. But know that if your condition ever worsens, I will seek help. Thanks. Having a sister like you is true happiness, if you ask me. That's your idea of true happiness? Don't be absurd. Well, what about you then? What brings you true happiness? Nothing. Really? You've got good friends, you got your health, none of that does it? I take joy in those things, to be sure, but I don't value happiness as a life goal. After all, what if I found it? Then my whole life afterward would be spent looking fondly back. <laughs> really? Even if something better comes along? The possibility that it never will is terrifying. I couldn't bear it. I've always yearned for happiness and saw only misery. Like the day I fled from the castle. If Thirine had fallen, or Mother died, or you were lost to us, I wondered, how would I respond? And now this? If things get worse and you have to leave, what will I... How can I... <sighs> hey, I'm not gonna die, okay? I'll be fine if I stick with my training. <sighs> you really do have the mind of a barbarian. If only you had the body to match. <laughs> I'll get there. That's why I work out. Whoa, Celine, look! You see that four-leaf clover? Mm-hmm. Where? Right by your foot. There you go. A small joy. A small joy. That takes me back. We often sought such things when we were younger. At that age, I was better at it than you. I wonder when you surpassed me. <sighs> Talking to you makes me feel better. Chalk up another small joy for me. I'm not certain that counts, but I'm relieved to hear that the worst has passed. Let me make it up to you, Celine. I'll find lots of little joys and bring them to you. I can't promise everything will be fine with me, but we can prop each other up. For Firine. Yes, Alfred. I will support you in anything. Whatever else happens, we can make sure we return to Firine. Together. Cool. Anyway, on with the other shite I've got to do. Whee! Of victory. 
plan level up to level 20, so he gets a upgrade on the horizon, strength, defense, and res. I'll take it. More defensive is always more good. Then Saline is also quite close. If she wins twice, she might get it. Depends who she fights. I am Saline, Princess of Firine. This should be a picturesque match. You cut me down most effectively. So I lost that one, but that's okay. We can try again. She's definitely the closest, yeah. Everyone else is a little bit far away, but Saline only has 10 XP to go. Saline has arrived. I'm Lapis. Get ready. I wasn't strong enough. What a joy this has been. Nice. And Saline is also at level 20 now. A defense and a look upgrade. Conversation is available between the two of them. So. With that, we can upgrade both of them, so I will do that. So, clan, change class, you will become the Mage Knight. Why can't you become a Sage? Just out of curiosity. You would need a uh, healing B, which I don't have. So I wonder, I guess I could give someone proficiency with B, uh, with um, healing. So I could give them Makaya and then you'd get healing proficiency and I could make you a sage. Which I think is actually what I want to do. I want, I want a sage. So having at least one sage is going to be useful. Uh, the mage knight is quite good, but it just has... Um, but has horse weakness and the magic stat doesn't actually increase with mage knight but will increase with sage so I'm going to actually fiddle around with that a minute but Saline for certain is going to take the Vidal plus one in everything it looks like yeah more move one more dodge three more avoid Magic wielding swordswoman who can cut through enemy mages. She's also capable of wielding staves and gets Ignis. May add half of strength to magic damage or half of magic to all other damage. With a percentage chance of 15... No, of uh, 14%. Right, this is definitely what I want. There's power budding in me. I will work diligently to help it bloom. Oh, right, and then so for for clan, all I've got to do is fight with the emblem, uh, Micaiah. Oh, well, Micaiah's not here. Have I got any way of getting that? Uh, no, I don't. So, I guess in that case, I just won't use clan for a bit until I get Micaiah back. Or until I get a way of getting um, staff proficiency. So I'll keep these master cores to the people who need it next. So that would be Jean, uh, Boucheron, and then Unako after that. Okay, right. So we got some more support conversations we can do. Boucheron A with Josephus. I feel just terrible about the other day, Divine One. I hope my poor sense of direction didn't stress you out even more. I wouldn't worry too much. We got home safely, and the whole thing was even kind of fun. Phew. That does make me feel better. So, how else do you relieve stress? I do enjoy a good book. Diving into a whole other world helps me forget about ours. I highly recommend this. It's a classic from my homeland called Love in Bloom. It's very... damp. And wrinkled. Oh, sorry about that. It's from Tears. Excuse me? It doesn't take much to get the waterworks going for me. That's why, uh... That's why I get misty just looking at the cover for this one. That's all it takes? Don't be fooled. Reading really is very relaxing. And this is one of my favorites. Uh, 
All right, then. Let's see here. <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna need a moment after seeing the table of contents. Is this for real? I'm sorry, Divine One. This can't be very relaxing. I'll leave you alone with the book. Uh, are you sure? I really don't mind. Besides, I think people would start to worry if they saw you walking around in tears. <laughs> oh, Divine One, you're too kind. Wait until we get to the introductory paragraph. <laughs> At this rate, we'll finish the war before the first chapter. <laughs> He's just a big softy. Right. Chloe and Lapis. <laughs> my goodness. Is my face so funny that you'd laugh as soon as you see it? Forgive me, Chloe. Though I wasn't laughing at you. Rather, it was the memory of the first time we met that has me so amused. Oh yes, how could I forget? My first encounter with the princess. You were at the harbor with your face scrunched up in tears. It was adorable. I wouldn't say I was in tears. The ship I meant to board couldn't set sail and I was grasping at straws. That's all. Which is when I made my entrance. I told you if there was some place you wanted to go, I could give you a ride on my Pegasus. And off we went to the tea farm. I'd snuck out of the castle incognito before, but this was something altogether different. I'd never ridden a Pegasus. I can remember my excitement like it was yesterday. The first of many grand adventures. That day is burned into my memory forever. When they told me you were the princess, I nearly keeled over with shock. I mean, how many people make friends with a girl who turns out to be royalty? <laughs> I'm sorry. I hope it wasn't too hard on your nerves. Oh, it was an honor. Like I was living a real fairy tale. You might say I started a new life that day. Indeed. You must elaborate. Oh, I'd be happy to. But not today. No? I have the time, if that's your concern. <laughs> oh, Princess Celine, The best fairy tales leave the audience wanting more. And then with Lapis. Lazuli. Oh my. What is that you're drinking, Lapis? It smells heavenly. Princess Saline, uh, this is regular tea. Yep, nothing special about it. Do you mind if I have a sip? What? No, you're a princess. You shouldn't be drinking this sort of thing. What's the harm in it? You seem to be suffering no ill effects. It's not that. It's, well... See, I didn't get the tea leaves from a shop. I harvested them from a wild plant nearby. Do you mean that you make your own tea? That's wonderful. Now I must insist that you let me try it. Uh, all right, if you insist. Here. Thank you. Oh, this is bracing indeed. I wasn't quite expecting the taste. You like it? I actually made the tea set by hand as well. You made this? Its finery would shame some artisans I know. I'm very impressed that you're able to make so many things all on your own. I appreciate that, but really, it's nothing special. Nonsense, Lapis. If it's not too much trouble, could you teach me to brew tea like this? I'd be interested in learning which wild plants to pick and how to brew tea from them. I'd be happy to. Let's go to the forest together sometime, and I'll teach you. Excellent. I shall pay close attention, my teacher of tea. She is into her tea. So, if she, if you can learn a thing or two, she would be very into that. Right, okay. So that's all done. So I've got to remember I'm not using clan. Don't use clan. He's level 20. Any XP you get on him is a waste. Doop 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 Yeah, so because a different day has happened, the uh, the skirmishes that existed have gone. Now, am I really going to do all of these skirmishes? I think I might be. I think I might be doing all of these skirmishes. Um... 
Or do I pick and choose? I guess that's the question. The actual quest wants me to be level 14 base class. All these want to be advanced classes at least. Um, my, my stupid bloody brain is like, yeah, but it's wasted XP if you don't do all of them. Obviously. Um, all right, fine. I will do this. I can get some deer. I can get some owls. Ooh. In the shadowy moor. Don't use clan. Don't use clan. Using clan would be your way, so don't use clan. Okay, so. These levels, or these quests, are too hard at the minute for my characters. So what that tells me is that I need to... Get everyone up to the level of about two or so before I can actually do anything else. So that means getting Jean up, you know, Boucheron, Yunaka, Louis, Chloe, like everyone up to about level two of the second class before I can do this. Now, these skirmishes will only get harder based on my uh, character's class, I believe. So Josephus's class. Because they're all getting to the difficulty of about advanced level 2. So I don't think we'll get any easier than this. So I think what we should do instead is go to a place of significance to Emblem of Lucina. Here the Divine Dragon will face an important trial in the Arena of the Gods power log. Which is what I wanted to do anyway, but I hoped to get a bit more strong by then. But base level 19 I should be able to do. I've done that before, so I think I can do it. Um, let us begin. Prologue, the Exalt. What is this place, Lucina? I feel a magical power here. This appears very similar to Arena Ferox. Most curious. Ferox? That's a place from your world, right? Yes. Ferox is a kingdom divided by East and West, with a militaristic Khan overseeing each. Every so many years, a fighting tournament is held to determine which Khan will rule them all. Arena Ferox is where I cross swords with my father. He taught you swordsmanship, yes? It must have been an interesting, if fierce, bout. Yes, it was a hard fight. He had no idea who I was and held nothing back. He trained me well, but that fight was when I first saw just how strong my father really was. That must be precisely why this familiar place was chosen as a trial ground. Trial ground? What does that mean? We each feel the extraordinary power here. Tell me what it feels like deep down. It's almost like I'm sensing your power, but also like you're far away. Well then, draw your weapon. Fight me. If you pass the trial, our bond will grow stronger. With a stronger bond, you will be able to draw upon more of my power as an emblem. I hope I can learn as much in this arena as you did. That's good to hear. However, it's going to require more than hope for you to win this battle. You're going to be surprised if you think I'm only bringing hope to this fight. That's the spirit. Yes, indeed. Don't use clan. Clan's a mistake. You're gonna get sad if you try to do that. <laughs> the, hub, the problem I've got is how do I upgrade Chloe when she's only level 11? I guess you just have to do arena fights and even when you lose you'll get experience. I can bring six people. Okay. Um, well, my best odds of winning are bringing all my most upgraded people with me. Um, but that's not going to help me get those people up to higher level. So, I would bring a healer, but Jean's already a healer. Am I making my life hard for myself? Yes. Does that surprise anyone? No. I guess I should bring one person that I would consider to be good. Etia is just so strong, I, I, I need to bring her. But everyone else, I want to get Yunaku and Louie up to a respectable level, so... Chloe will have to wait. I just don't think level 11 is going to cut it. If we look at the, the fight, we've got some level 1 lads, like some tier 2 people, I mean. 
Having no mages is going to make killing the knights interesting, but that's fine. And then Lucina herself is, of course, a, a 25 emblem. She has the Parthia, the Parallel Falchion, and the Noble Rapier. I don't think she'll come and attack me yet, though. Right. Don't hold back. Strengthen our bond. Fight with everything you've got. I'll try. I'll do my best. I need yes. to start. I want to be on the offensive all the time. Point away again. Let me at him. Now, I think Play there might be reinforcements need. from these staircases. Your orders, please. Yeah, they're coming. Okay. I'll save you. I am the divine dragon. Thank you for the chain guard. This I appreciate time, it. Victory was mine. Wonderful. Okay, so let's be interested in the right hand side. So I'm not interested in the, the mage this second. I'm interested in who can get attacked from here. I'm quite okay to play a passive game for the minute. I, won't falter. I don't actually want to keep critting these people to kill them, because I don't need to keep leveling up to Cephas, but if they want to fight me, then that's fine. Okay, so, what do you have as a magic? Thoron. So you can hit me from no matter where I am, basically. So, if you hit me, I die. So I might as well use the Iron Bow, which will kill you if I hit you. So I need to, I guess first, I will punch you to death. Break for 10. Bonk, bonk. Okay. Then I can actually get Yunaka in to kill you off. Was that too much? Which is a lot of XP for me. Yunaka's level 17, gets speed, defense, and res. Thousand more money and ten gold. More XP for Boucheron, which is what I want. I guess Louis should go up here just in case this is XP two. It is. And someone with half decent res should be coming here. The general can I can fight the general. Hit me. No! I've got to take some damage, so it's fine. As I said, killing a general might actually be a bit tricky. Right, so in this situation, what I want to do is back up so I don't get bodied by the mage specifically. Here until the end. There's somewhere that only the general can hit me, that's fine. Kind of. Cool. Keep coming. This way I can attack them when they come and attack me. That's what I wanted to do. I'm not always an idiot. Sometimes I do have an idea for how I'm going to do something. Right, so Boucheron, your best bet is to compact axe them to death. So to do that, I would like to fly away. Come fly with me. Uh, right, so you're going to hurt me for that, but only if you hit me. So I could be okay. Bonk. Bonk. Nice XP. That gets Yunaka out of my way, so now I can tomahawk the shit out of you. You're killing a level 2 unit, so it's actually going to give you quite a lot of XP. Yeah, 16. Um, okay. Louis. I'd rather you fought the general, so you can tank that. You might not hit the general, you might hit Yunaka, but... She has 18 speed, you only have 7, so... All right. Even if I can't hurt you, I still at least double you, so that's good. Chill there. I can, I can pounce. It's a risky business, but I can pounce. I would like to punch you. Sean's actually quite strong in terms of his punching power. I'll move over here, because I don't want you to attack yourself, as I'd rather you attack someone else. Hit him. Bye bye. I'm not afraid anymore. 
Come then. That's what I was worried about. Ooh! But you missed me, it's fine. I was worried that I wouldn't be able to do any damage to them. Getting the double poison is quite useful. Yeah, so like... I need to throw the big guns out to kill them. I'll kill you, hopefully. Well, you won't kill me, so that's fine. Yeah. Nice. You're level 17 axe fire, so I can actually hurt you. If I use the fail nought, I can do quite a lot of damage to you, actually. Fail me not. Get ready for the Bye. Who's next? Okay. Chill here. Whoever they want to attack is fine. You won't kill them, so it's it's okay. That was a mistake. That's fine. Bye then. Another thousand gold. Right, so now we're spinning forward. Get all of our shit as we go along. We're moving up. Come then, Lucina. Engage with me. What's wrong? You won't win just by standing there. Your stance has no openings. I don't see how I could hit you, no matter where I strike. Doubt will only dull your attacks. Trust in yourself, and come at me with everything. Understood. Here I come. Yeah. Can't hit me back, and I can poison you for this. Your insolence. Now, if I can hit you and kill you instantly, yeah, I'll rewind if I need to. But this is this is what I need to do to break your guard. Bonk. Who's next? Nice, nice. Okay, so now I can stand next to you again, and compact axe you, which does less damage, but it's more likely to hit. Bonk. Then Jean with a big kill. No, I'm joking. Louis can kill you, though. Do it. Firstly. I'll manage. Yeah, okay. I can't get that XP, but it doesn't matter. Just kill them, mate. Let me help. So strong. Bye bye. <laughs> Josephus. I'm the best. Of course. The exalt. And that's actually the end of the episode then. It's, this is a continuation from the last part, so it's actually going to be closer to two hours long, I, th I would think, because it's another 50 minutes I've been recording. I lost. Your combat skills have grown admirably. Compared to when we first met, you've grown strong and become a formidable opponent. Thank you. It is in no small part because of your guidance, Lucina. Such kind words. If I helped you at all, then I couldn't be happier. There's a lesson there, you know. What one person can achieve on their own is limited. I agree. I couldn't have come this far by myself. Everything I've accomplished has been thanks to those who have fought beside me. I'm relieved to hear that. I feel my friends close by even now. Their spirits live on in me. Their spirits live on. The power of my bonds with them helped us to change a hopeless future. The same as you are now, with your own allies. You're one of those allies, Lucina. Aren't you? Of course. I'll fight with you until the very last. Then we can't lose, no matter what the world sends our way. 
You're right. Our bonds are far stronger than destiny. Cool. Max bond level unlocked. So now I can get up to bond level 20, I'm assuming. So I guess all of the emblems are going to have that. That's why I couldn't get past 10 with some of them. Oh, I see. Right. See you guys next time when we go on to do the actual story mission, because I clearly can't do any of the other levels. <laughs> see you then. Goodbye.